using class time. One of the major benefits of preparing these type of video tutorials is that the students do not have to experience the lecturing during class time. In other words, once that you're done with your video recording, they can take it home or they can take it anywhere else and they can watch it in their own time. That frees your class time for other type of activities that will significantly change your instruction because most probably you're not gonna create these video recordings just to play them at the time of class. So one of the things that I have done after several years of working with this type of video lessons is to look into what type of collaborative learning techniques are out there that will enable me to engage the students with the content and to try to cement it well as we move forward. For these collaborative learning techniques, I have been guiding my work based on this book. And this book has certain sections that are well written for internet related activities. However, I have been doing a lot of adaptations in my own and I am now engaging my students into collaborative learning techniques online and in real time. Nonetheless, this can also work very well for classes that are in person. So I will recommend that you look at a book like this one and think about what are the ways in which your students can participate with each other and with you in order to bring that content that you presented in your video recording and cement it well. The other thing that you can do during class time is to engage in evaluation practices. And this could be you actually doing the evaluation in a typical way, like a quiz, like exams, or it could be simple questions and answers. Or you can engage in things like peer evaluation in which students gather together in groups, as many, as big as you want those groups to be, and check that all of your students have covered all of the material in your video lessons. And that is a very quick and easy way to keep your students moving at a steady pace throughout the entire semester instead of having them procrastinate. And from my experience, peer evaluation brings many different benefits to the educational experience. Not only it keeps the pace, as I just mentioned, but also gives the students a perception of where they are in comparison with their peers.